Hey guys, welcome to At Home Eats, and this is a, another quick tip video. It's going to be a pop up video for my ultimate pizza crust, okay? And I'm really excited about this pizza crust. It's so good, and it allows us to get more fiber in our diet, which is good for our uh, GI systems. It helps keep us full so we don't snack on other things that may not be that great for us. It's good for our circulation. Fiber is needed in our diets for sure. And so this pizza will help us get some of that fiber into our diets. So let's get started. All right, guys. So we're starting with my ultimate pizza crust. So let's get started with that. Now in our big bowl here, I've got our flour ingredients, which is a cup of all-purpose flour and a cup of whole wheat flour, as well as about a teaspoon of salt. And then we're gonna actually gonna add some oregano and pepper to the crust because I love to have a flavored crust. It adds a nice Italian flavor and I just love to have that extra kind of kick in the crust. So I added that to the crust. Then we're gonna actually have our wet ingredients to mix our yeast in. So we have about a half a cup of water, two teaspoons of sugar, and about a package, an entire package of yeast. It's gonna kinda get a little foamy, which looks a little weird, <laughs> but it's okay. That means that it's working, right? We, need, we want our yeast to work. It's uh, working on that sugar that's in there feeding. So we're gonna add that to our dry ingredients, our flour ingredients, and then we're just actually gonna mix it. And we're gonna mix until we get all of the ingredients incorporated and just make sure that we do not overwork the dough, but we wanna make sure that we get everything incorporated as much as possible. And so I've got a nice, wonderful dough ball there which is about ready for us to start to roll out. Now I am playing with our dough, which again, we all love to do that, right? That's a, a fun way to get the kids involved. I was able to add some oil to the outside of it to make it work a little bit better for me. And then I'm just gonna add more flour to the pizza dough and the surface. And then we're just gonna Make sure that you put the flour on the rolling pin as well to avoid it sticking. And then we're just going to roll this baby out. And it's okay if it's oblong at first. We can always make sure that it's rounded. But we kind of just work with what we've got. And then the more we kind of work the pizza dough, the more it'll, the elasticity will improve. And then we're able to kind of shape it to what we'd like. So... If there's holes in it, that is okay. You just roll right over it. Again, it's pizza dough. We can shape it to whatever we'd like. And then we're just gonna ever so slightly take it off of our, uh, our surface and add it to our pizza pan. And then we're actually gonna kinda turn up the sides to make like this really cool crust looking crust. Now, you can fold it over if you'd like. I like the pinching technique. I think it gives it a nice little texture at the end. I think it makes the pizzas look extra cool. And I just love to do that. So we just pinch it. So we just push and pinch, push and pinch. And we got a close up here to kind of show that and what it looks like. Uh, you can also use that technique if you're making like a like a, a pie crust or something like that. That's also great. Now my final tip is to put forks at the bottom. Now that helps air out the pizza crust and helps it cook thoroughly so you don't have any of those doughy moments when we eat our pizza and it helps it cook a lot quicker. So that is my end tip for our ultimate pizza crust. And then we're gonna put it in the oven on 425 for about 15 minutes or so until the bottom is springy and we're able to be able to uh, touch it. And obviously it'll be warm to the touch and it'll just come bounce back ever so slightly like that in the close up there. Now, thank you guys for watching our ultimate pizza crust video and I will see you in the continuation where we use this pizza crust to make our barbecue chicken pizza. See you there.